Now my name is Quincy Green and I'm the Youth Support Coordinator here at the Motor Museum. I've been an HIV tester since 2002. On December 1st, we celebrate World AIDS Day, but at the Mutter Museum, we'll be offering free HIV tests on Saturday, December 2nd from 9 to 2 p.m. With the 60-second NC test, you'll get free admission to the Mutter Museum. It's important that you know your status, and what I'll do for you is actually test myself right before your eyes. This is a very simple 60-second test. So first things, sanitize my hands, get on gloves. So because I'm testing myself, I will use a lancet. I will prick my finger, so I use an alcohol pad to clean the area. And it's usually best to use one of your fingers that has the most surface area. So I usually use my middle finger, allow that to dry. When you're doing the finger stick, it's best that you do it on either the left or right side of your finger. That's where the most surface area is and there's no bone. Okay, simple little prick. And these lancets are good, you don't actually really feel it. Then you squeeze to get a drop of blood. Add it to vial one, and shake it up. And you'll pour this into the first one. and less than 60 seconds, the result is there. One dot means that it's a negative result. Two dots means a positive result. Now, a negative result just means that there were no antibodies detected by this test. There's something called the window period. The window period means that it takes anywhere from 10 days to six months for antibodies for HIV to be present and able to be detected by this instrument, which is why the CDC recommends that you get tested every three to six months. A positive diagnosis today means that you have a chronically treatable illness. HIV can be easily managed, usually one pill a day, for the rest of your life to remain undetectable and relatively healthy. So come out on December 2nd from 9 a.m. to 2 p.m. and know your status and also get free admission to the Martin Museum.